decade, we're going to reach the moon and we'll figure it out. I mean, they didn't even have all the technology in place to be able to say yeah, that, yeah. but it was like putting that vision forward and people really believing that, giving them the confidence that like, we're going to get there together. Um, and, and, and that to me is leadership. Okay. Wonderful. I like that. But tell me one thing, if it's about the, giving the people that confidence and having that vision, like when you're starting out as a new leader, where do I get that confidence from? Baby steps. Okay. What do you mean? Yeah. So, uh, as the leader, how do you get the confidence? You mean? Yeah. Like, uh, let's say I'm a brand yeah. new leader, right? And I don't have yeah, yeah. the confidence yet because I'm uh, first time I've ever yep. been put in a leadership position. Yeah. yeah. Now. So, ba- so baby steps, and I'll explain that. Yeah. I remember when I started Launch Good, um, I was trying to raise funding, and and I failed. No, no one should come to me for VC advice. I, I, I'm very good at not getting VC funding. Thank yeah. God. So. Uh, we went to Silicon Valley. We met with like these big shot investors. And one of them, his name was Osama Badir, he said, Chris, is this a billion dollar idea? And it, it's just like caught me off guard. I'm like, I just, uh, like that's a large it's billion. billion. Wow. Yeah. You know, he's like, Chris, stop. I'm going to stop. He's like, if you don't believe it's a billion dollar idea, no one else will. I've got, you know, I, I mean, three, four of the entrepreneurs today all think they have the next billion dollar idea. So why should I invest in you if you don't even believe in yourself? And it was hard. It's like, how could I believe in myself? Like, mm-hmm. we hadn't even got off the ground yet. Um, but then, you know, a year later, uh, we had raised a million dollars. And I was like, oh, that's pretty good. You know, like, we, I could. And then the year after that, it was like six million. And the year after that, it was like 15 million. And, you know, how now we're almost at $100 million raised through our platform. Wow. Sure. So now I can say, yeah, Launch Good is a billion dollar idea. Mm. But I have that confidence only because I can see the steps that we're taking towards that. And so I think as a leader, you don't always have to have, um, especially if you're inexperienced, you don't have to have uh, this brash confidence because I think that can be misleading. Um, but each, you know, there's a, an Arabic saying I love, and najah najah, that success begets success. So it's like, it's just those baby steps. Like I remember when we got to $100,000 funds raised, that was after six months. And we made a big celebration of that. In hindsight, like hundred thousand dollars is like nothing. Like if if we only raise a hundred thousand dollars in a month, it's like alarm bells going off, you know. <laughs> yeah. um, but at the time, you celebrate it. So I think a lot of entrepreneurs. There, there's a, a, another saying, and I, I'm full, you know, full of these cliches today. But Good. Bill Gates, I believe, said, uh, you know, we often underestimate or overestimate what we can accomplish in a year, but underestimate what we accomplish in ten years. Mm. And so I think, I think, you know, don't. People don't need to be so concerned about the big, big, big goal, but make sure that they're they're making those baby steps. 